Hi everyone, today we will learn about Token Custom Templates. In this video, we will cover four main sections such as Definition, Why do we need to use templates, where we can use them in token and how to use templates in token. So what templates are? A template is a pattern that you follow to give you desired results. Templates basically enforce overall consistency by having a predetermined structure and layout. All documents made using a template will match its layout exactly, as the definition mentions. Now, let's see why do we need to use the templates. Templates actually increase flexibility, they are easy to update and they provide consistency across the project. They can be improved regularly to meet technological and instructional requirements. These are easily dragged and updated. So, where we can use them in token? We can use them in agent application, customer application, token forms, bulk CSV file, etc. How to use templates in token? So, let's get started. Now, on the dashboard, you need to go to the settings. Then select templates. In the custom templates, you can select from the library any field which is already been made. So these are the pre-made templates or you can create a custom one as per as your requirement. So for example, I'll be creating a test template, add the field name. Now you can select that agent can read only, read and write or it's a hidden field. So for me, I'm going to put read and write. Now the field type could be anything. It could be a bar, checkbox or a text. For me, it's going to be a number. Now, I can select is it mandatory for the agent to fill this field or is it non-mandatory uh, as per as your requirement but for me I will put it mandatory. Now you can either select it edit before task to uh, enable your agents to edit the uh, field first before starting the task. Now you can add as many as number of fields as per your requirement. You can delete any. Uh, as per as your use case and howsoever. So uh, this this particular template suits me and my use case so I will go and save it. Now I'll go back to the dashboard. So now let's create a test task and test our template. I'll create a task. Select the date. Now here in this section you can select a template. You can select the template that you have created. Now catch here is that for one job you can only select one template. So you can see the value and everything. You can either select it as default template if this, this is the only template you want to use for all the jobs. You can use different uh, templates for different customers as well. So now let us let me create this task and see what happens in the agent application. As you can see, I have received the notification. I will show it to you on the agent application as well. So in the agent application, agent has received the task, he will accept it and as you can see, I can see the address and time, I will start it. In this field, I have to add the number, I will add, let's say I have 10 packages and then mark it successful. So this is how we use templates and agent applications. I hope this video helped. Thank you.